hepatitis B and liver cancer. Hello friends welcome to our Health Poster YouTube channel. In this video we will discuss why chronic hepatitis B is the cause of liver cancer. So, please watch this video till end. If you are new to our channel, please subscribe our channel. Chronic hepatitis B infection and alcohol these are the leading cause of liver cancers and non-alcoholic fatty liver disease called NAFLD. It may rapidly increase the symptoms of liver cancer. The main reason of risk factors of NAFLD are mainly obesity and type 2 diabetes and metabolic syndrome. Hepatocellular carcinoma, HCC. Another reason is hepatocellular carcinoma, HCC. It is one of the five major cancers in the world population. As per research said, hepatitis B virus, HBV, is the most important factor of liver cancer. HCC is not detected in the early stage. As per research, liver cancer is rarely detected in early stage. It is the fastest increasing cancer now these days. So that's why chronic hepatitis B patient need to follow up regular checkup and consult with an expert liver doctor as well. Symptoms of HCC. These symptoms are seen in the HCC patients including pain in the upper right part of your belly, a lump or feeling heaviness in upper abdomen, bloating or swelling in the belly, mild fever, loss of appetite and feelings of fullness, weight loss and weakness or deep fatigue, nausea and vomiting, pale, chalky bowel movements and dark urine. Prevention of CHB. The prevention of chronic hepatitis B virus infection can successfully reduce the occurrence of liver cancer. However, CHB infection can lead to chronic hepatitis, liver cirrhosis, hepatocellular carcinoma, HCC, and liver cancers. Hepatitis B. C viruses responsible for 80% liver cancers. Mainly hepatitis B and C is almost responsible for 80% of liver cancers in the world. The main reason is the majority of prime liver cancers which are from untreated chronic hepatitis B or C infection in the long run. What is primary liver cancer? As per research said, Primary liver cancer is one of the fastest increasing causes of cancer death in the world and it is also the cause of increasing incidence of all cancers in body. Liver cancer patient can alive maximum 5 years after diagnosis due to endurance remains as low. What are the risks in liver cancer? It is noticed. Patients with liver cirrhosis or patients with a family history of liver cancer or chronic hepatitis B patient especially male with age is greater than or equal to 40 years might be responsible for making liver cancer in future. How does liver cancers progress? Hepatocellular cancer can start after a long period if you are suffering from chronic hepatitis B and C these viruses are attack the liver and continuously weakens its ability to perform important tasks like filtering toxins from your blood and maintaining the level of sugar in your blood. Liver cirrhosis can be caused by too much alcohol or chronic hepatitis B or C infection. Another reason is autoimmune diseases attack to the liver tissues. 10% of liver patients do liver transplants in the world due to hepatitis B. 61% of liver cancer diagnoses because of chronic hepatitis B. 43% of liver cancer patients get death because of chronic hepatitis B. 790,000 people die from liver cancer annually. 15% to 26% of people with chronic hepatitis B at birth die prematurely from cirrhosis, liver failure, or hepatocellular carcinoma. How to identify liver cancers. However, liver cancer in patients with cirrhosis or hepatocellular carcinoma progressed silently. So, patients need to check abdominal ultrasound, lower and upper tests, liver fibroscan, alpha fetoprotein, AFP tests are in every six months, a liver biopsy. MRI and CT scan. Imaging tests are required like ultrasound, CT scan, or MRI to look for tumors in your liver as prescribed by your doctor. 
Ultrasound creates images of your liver with sound waves whereas a CT scan that makes detailed pictures inside your body. MRI uses to get strong magnets and radio waves to make an image of your liver. Liver biopsy. A liver biopsy test can explain the actual liver condition going on presently. In this test your doctor may take a sample of your liver tissue and check and analyze it for cancer cells. In the next video we will discuss on diet plan for hepatitis B patients. Please find out this video in our channel. If you like this video, please like and subscribe our channel. Please share with us in the comment box if you have any new tips or ideas about hepatitis B infection are welcome.